Hi, everybody. I don't know about you, but when I was a teenager, I was a whole lot smarter than I am now. So therefore, I knew everything, and I didn't pay any attention to warning signs. So my, between my junior and senior year of high school, my family went to visit an aunt and uncle who lived in Delaware. We lived in Indiana. My aunt and uncle lived in a development that had a swimming club. So my brother and sister and I got all ready and we went down to the club. And of course, the first person I saw was the lifeguard. <laughs> and he was really cute and tan. And we hit it off really well, really fast. So we started hanging out. And on day two, day three, we were hanging out. And then this girl, who I had no idea who she was, comes up to me and pulls me aside. And she says, the lifeguard is my brother. And you really don't want to have anything to do with him. <laughs> so this is warning sign number one, which I completely ignored. So we continued to have a long distance relationship. So my, this is kind of an aside. Um, my given name is Melissa. My family always called me Lissa, but for some mysterious reason, instead of spelling it like Melissa without the M-E, they spelled it with only one S. So when you wrote it, it looked like Lisa. So long distance relationship, my to-be uh, called me Lisa. So one night, he calls me on the phone. My father answers. He says, hi, is Lisa there? And my father says, I'm sorry. You must have the wrong number and hung up. So warning sign number two is if your boyfriend can't get your name right, maybe you ought to run the other way. But of course, I wouldn't do that. So um, then a couple years pass. He's graduating from college, and I'm just starting college. So we're talking marriage. So I said, you know, I'd really like to finish school before we get married. And he said, well, I'm not going to wait that long. <laughs> Warning sign number three. But what did I do? I quit school and got married. So needless to say, the marriage did not last, um, unfortunately. But um, this is a story about not heeding warning signs, but somehow the God of my understanding has a great way of turning lemons into lemonade, because today, I am blessed with a wonderful son, daughter-in-law, and three great grandkids. So thank you.